Graham is going after New Yorkers this tax season. Yeah, facing a massive budget deficit, the state is joining the IRS in cracking down on tax cheats. James Ford live at an IRS office in Times Square where your tax returns will go under the microscope. James. Well, I'll tell you, we've got good news and bad news to report on this story. The good news first, in this economy where tens of thousands of jobs are shed every week, there's actually an entity that's hiring. The bad news is they're hiring so that they can keep closer tabs on you. You know the expression that there are two things you can't avoid. One is death. But because enough people aren't doing this, paying their appropriate taxes, the state of New York will add to its roster of these people tax auditors. New York's Department of Taxation and Finance says it will hire 300 more people to audit you. If and you want to know why they're going to do that? Because of the $750 billion bailout package, and now Obama wants 800 and something billion dollars for another bailout scheme. That's why they're cracking down, because now they got to look how much can they fuck out of the common Joe's ass. Uh, you are not one of those types of people that are like organized enough, then it's a headache for you. But if you're one of those organized people, then whatever, it's the flip of a switch. And which one are you? I'm somewhere in the middle. Puts it down in my pocket, they do audit me, but I have nothing to hide, so I should be alright. And with the state facing a $15 billion deficit for the next two years, it needs to find every penny owed to... Must I say it? They're printing money again. We don't have money, but they're printing cash like it's going out of style. Let me tell you something. We all can't report the taxes the way we fucking make it. You know why? We won't have any money after they get through with us. They're fucking butt-fucking us as it is. And then, then we gotta report every fucking inkling penny we make? We have to lie on our taxes. Yeah, we got this dependent we don't have. Yeah, we haven't claimed this money that we haven't claimed from getting in tips. Because they'll butt fuck us out of every nickel dime that we have now. Expect the federal government to do the same. The irony of that is that this man, Treasury Secretary Timothy Geithner, oversees the IRS, and before he was confirmed, he had to pay $34,000 in payroll taxes he had neglected. I don't know why any of us are paying taxes. If the folks in Washington... They're setting the example for the rest of us, aren't they? The people most likely to be targeted are the self-employed, small business owners, and people who work from home. There's a... The Common Joe! They might as well put the fucking word Common Joe on that screen. And you know why? Because that's where all these categories fit. Okay? The working class. The guy that pays the taxes. That's who's getting butt fucked here. Because they're going to look after they take all the money that they, have, that they have taken from us throughout the years. All the money they have taken from our kids. Throughout the years, our grandparents, our great-grandparents, and now they're spending it and giving it away to every rich motherfucker they could find. Now they're going to go look up our asses with microscopes. It's one published report of a person who made tax deductions for a home office, and an auditor went out to the man's home to make sure the claim was true. And you know why he has a home office? Because he can't afford a regular office. Okay? That's why he has a home office. Because they can't afford the rent on a regular office and make a living off of what he does. Okay? It isn't that, but they're going to go up his ass with a microscope and a telescope and all that shit to make sure they get every fucking nickel out of this motherfucker. Jesus Christ, man. How about looking up the fucking fat cats in Washington's ass? The ones that are fucking around with that $800 billion. The money that could make us all rich and take us out of the fucking debt we're in now. And you're looking at a big reason why the state and the feds are going after your tax dollar. This is the national debt clock. which is A debt that they created. The fat cat. 
the federal government, Bloomberg, all those motherfuckers created this debt. And now they're going after the common Joe to butt fuck us. Jesus Christ. Showing that this country is $10.65 trillion in debt. Up about $29 million just in the last hour and a half. The yeah, last times are tight. But if you're one of those people who just gets a W-2 and uses that. You hear that? Listen, listen. That's my dog. He's pissed off at the fucking thing. You know why? Because they're lying to us. You know what that debt is made of? All the fuck-ups they did. And then they have the balls to go in the fucking and whip out $800 billion. This is the new administration. They're whipping out $800 billion on top of the $750 billion. In other words, we could have made the American people, every single one of us, U.S. citizens, American people, rich, fat cats like they are, but they won't do it. You know why? Because then they'll be just common people. They want to be above us and shove their foot up our ass every chance they get. Okay? This is just another butt fuck in the ass of the American people. To figure out your taxes, you're much less likely to get audited. But the bottom line is, there will be more audits this year than we've seen in quite some time. Reporting live from the Times Square neighborhood of Manhattan, I'm James Ford. Sukanya? All right. That's because they're going to go up our asses with a microscope and see what the fuck we got. Let's hear what Airhead Sukanya has to say. James, thank you. In addition to cracking down on your income taxes, the state says it will make a big push to collect unreported sales tax from businesses. Well, right. Flavio 13 out. You got a lot to say.